Hi, this is Michelle Aiden with Libertas Institute at the Capitol with Representative Roberts to talk about his food freedom bill. Can you just tell us a little bit about the bill? Sure, the bill uh, copies uh, to a certain degree what Wyoming did last year. It enables producers and consumers to interact more closely in the consumption and acquisition of food products. So if I'm a producer and I sell direct to the consumer my food products, it removes all state oversight um, from that transaction. I don't have to get inspected, licensed, um, all those types of things, and makes that transaction a little bit easier. Uh, consumers are driving this. They want to know where their food comes from. They're informed. They understand it. And uh, a transaction directly from the producer, uh, I don't think we need to, uh, I think it's reasonable to remove all state oversight from that. Cool. Um... Why would you say there are such strict regulations on small food producers? Well, I think one is to prohibit competition, um, and but you will hear that in the form of people will get sick and die. So they say people get sick and die, but re what they really mean is we don't want competition. Okay. Um, this is called the Food Freedom Act. What does your bill do for freedom? It allows people uh, to interchange goods and services freely with each other on a direct one-to-one -one basis. So if I'm looking for a certain type of food product, I can search it out in the market, find a producer who's created it, and, and be able to make that transaction without any government interference. Right, great. Um, and last question, are there any cases that you can just describe briefly in Utah of the government cracking down on these small food producers? Uh, I think there's been some cases uh, with some poultry, uh, guys who raise poultry over the last few years. I'm sure there have been some cases on, on dairy. There have I know some cases on other food products that uh, uh, the departments come in required them to build these big commercial kitchens and what not to produce their food uh, and sell it direct. Um, I don't have them all, all the different cases around my head, but there are a number of cases. Quite a few, okay. Great, thank you so much for your time. Um, okay. For any other information or questions or to contact your legislator, just click the link in the description below.